What is up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. Yes, sir. It's your boy once again. You already know the vibes. Welcome back. Welcome back. Um, before the video even starts, you already know it's gonna be fly. You already know it's gonna be fire. So do me a favor and like the video for me right now. And if you already subscribed, send this video out to everyone you know, man. The whole contact list. Just send all of them, man. Tell them to subscribe. And, it, and if you're not subscribed, I don't even know what you're waiting for to keep it a buck with you. Subscribe, man, for real. But I appreciate all y'all for real, man. Like, for real. I know I say that all the time, man. But, like, I really do appreciate y'all for real. Because I know I don't have this big following. I just started on YouTube at the end of the day. Like, I know that. We know that. I just started at this. But the fact that even five of y'all are tuning into my videos literally every every week, tuning in, talking to me about it, suddenly enjoy it, it means a lot to me, man. It makes me just want to keep getting better and better and better at this YouTube thing. I'm the type of person I just want to be the best at everything. So I'm going to keep doing that with this YouTube thing. I'm going to just keep getting better and better. Every video you see, I want it to be better than the last. So I'm going to work at it, man, for y'all. Um, This past week, I just found myself getting better at fashion, if that makes sense. Like, I'll be finding mad brands and finding... Um, just thinking about clothes and putting different stuff together and all that this week So I want to do the same with YouTube Like I'm saying, I just want to keep getting better and better Just becoming a student of this YouTube thing and this fashion thing, man, for real, I'm serious But, like, so I just really appreciate y'all at the end of the day But, today's video is a little different from the old videos, man Um, we just had the Grammys last week So I was thinking, instead of what everyone else be doing on YouTube The regular stuff, just waiting these celebrities fits I'm gonna take it a little deeper for y'all I'm, I'm gonna give y'all my biggest takeaways from the Grammys Because Grammys, at the end of the day Is when artists really pop out They really go crazy with their outfits They really try to show off on the red carpet, all that So, instead of just waiting the fits Like you see everyone do Like vlogs and all that I'm not one of those vlogs, I'm different We fly on this channel, we the different so I'm just gonna take you my biggest takeaways from what I've seen. Um, we gonna get right into it, man. All right, so this video is probably gonna be on the shorter side. I got three takeaways for you, three key takeaways for y'all. And I'm gonna I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I didn't even watch the Grammys. <laughs> yes, yes. I'm making a takeaway video without even watching the Grammys. Yes, I watched. <laughs> I had exams and stuff, you know, I had just had midterms, so, you know, I didn't have time to watch the Grammys, but I watched, like, the highlight, the highlights of it, you know, the top performances, the top things, all that, so I got some key takeaways for y'all, so first up on the list for the, my first takeaway is about Billie Eilish, we all know about Billie Eilish, she be making headlines all the time, but this takeaway is about, um, her style, of course, Billie Eilish is one of the perfect examples she might be the perfect example. The only other person that comes to mind is Uzi. But she might be the perfect example of having your own style. Like, her style is so... For the Grammy, she had this full... I'll put it up on the screen for y'all. She had this full Gucci um, dress. And what's crazy about it is her nails even looked like it was part of the dress. Like, that's just different. And it's a dress that no one would wear. Like, it just fits her style. It's super unique. And she pulls it off all the time because she's confident. This is why it's important to have your own style. So you can be confident in what you're wearing. You can wear anything at the end of the day. She's a perfect example of having your own style and feeling confident in your own style. It's like, bro, like, for real. Like, she's really going crazy with that. Like, even though I wouldn't, I like, I don't like her style for me, I like her style for her. Like, it fits her. And that's the important thing with fashion. You need your style to fit you. So that's why you can't be copying other people's outfits. You can't just be wearing something because someone else is wearing You got to fit yourself. And she's a perfect example of that. Like I said, the only person that comes to mind is Uzi. Like, if you look at clothes, if you look at clothes online, if you look at, you see an ad for clothes or whatever, you could tell, like, oh, that's something Uzi would wear. Oh, that's something Billie Eilish would wear. Because that's how that's, they identify their own style. Like, that's crazy. Bro, she really has her own style. And that's my biggest takeaway. She might be the perfect example of music today of someone just having their own style and owning it. Like, it makes me look forward to what she's gonna wear because it's always, it's always different. It's always like, oh, I would've never thought about wearing that. It just pushes the boundaries of fashion. Now, don't get me, don't get it wrong. I don't, I'm not saying Billie Eilish and Uzi are the only examples of this, but that's not true at all. Cause you know, Playboy Cardi is doing the same thing, but I think Billie Eilish is really one of the perfect examples for sure. Um, it just shows, this is why fashion is an art. This is exactly why fashion is art. Because you may not like her style. You may not like what she's wearing. But she's pulling it off. Because she's confident in it. That's, that's amazing. Alright, so my next takeaway is about the baby. And I don't want to single out the baby. Because this is honestly true for most rappers today. Like, it's, it's pretty true for almost every rapper. Um, 
the baby, I'm starting to think he's only fly because he has money. Like this fit right here that he popped out with the Grammys, it's a fire fit, don't get it wrong. This fit's very clean, but it just screams, I'm rich, I have money. <laughs> like, don't get it wrong, like you fly because you have money, but I'm just starting to think if you didn't have money, you wouldn't be as fly because all your clothes on your on your gram and all that they all have um designer on it they all burberry they all chanel they all that like i don't see you putting different pieces together but fashion you you never came out as a fashion icon under that so i can't even expect that i'm just saying i just took a takeaway that you you are fly but you fly only because you have money um that's my so if you're looking at like an inspiration of like someone to look up to to find your style, I wouldn't necessarily look at the baby because he's only fly because he has money. In my eyes, you know, I could be wrong. Like, who, I didn't know him when he was broke. I didn't see what he was popping out when he was broke. I don't know none of that. I'm just saying, I just think he wouldn't be fly if he didn't have money. Because this fit right here, it screams, I'm rich. I'm rich. You rich, bro. You got it. <laughs> my last key takeaway. Dua Lipa slide. She got it, bro. Honestly, I, I looked at like different, I looked at the best fits for the Grammys and all that. And she had the best fit of the Grammys for the female side. And I was like, is this like a one-time thing? So I went on her gram, I like went on Pinterest, looked up her fits. She's fly. Like I'll put a couple of her fits up, but she's actually fly. So was, like ladies, if you're looking for a new inspiration and how to find your style, check her fits out. Cause she be popping out. Like she has her own style, not as defined as Billie Eilish, of course, because Billie Eilish is like, as I said, the perfect example of having your own style. But she is very fly. She gives me like a Rita Ora type vibe. She's not as fly as Rita. I'm not saying that, but she gives me that type of vibe. She can be in the future. Like, she's fly. Dua Lipa, she could dress for real. So ladies, like, if you're looking just how to put pieces together, well, like, check her out. Because I didn't even know about her before this, to be honest. I didn't know about her at all. I, I don't see her as a fashion icon. I don't see her name in the fashion community. I don't see none of that. Maybe she's in there, I just don't see it. But like, after the Grammys and after like, I just looked at her fits, but she she could dress. Like she knows how to put different pieces together. She knows what she's doing. She looks confident in it. Like she knows what she's doing. Um, Those are my three takeaways. I have one honorable mention, only because I couldn't figure out like what to take away from it. It's just a fact that I just think it's crazy. Um, Lil Baby, crazy performance by the way. One of the best performances I've ever seen. That performance is so top five. Dude, oh, shout out to the baby. His, his performance with Roddy Rich, that was very, that was very, very tough. They, bro, all these artists are fantastic in what they do. Like, they are all so good at That's why they had the Grammys. They all fen phenomenal at their crap. But back to Lil Baby. Um, little takeaway. You saw how he was wearing the vest um, while he performed. I'll put it up. Um, he got this customized with 20,000 crystals. They said over 20,000 crystals. 20,000 crystals on the vest. And then the mask he was wearing had another 3,000 crystals in the mask. That's over 23,000 crystals, bro, of just customized. So we know Lil Baby got money, but this is just crazy because people with money don't even be doing this. Like, I never seen that. I never seen that headline. Um, bro, I, I couldn't take away. I, I don't know what to take away from that. I just want to share it because I think that's crazy. So shout out to Lil Baby. He's one of my favorite rappers. So like, I, I had thrown me in, man. No cap. But those are my key takeaways from the Grammys. Although I didn't watch it, you know, I still took away some stuff to give to y'all. Um, like I'm saying, I'm going to keep providing for y'all. I'm going to keep getting better at better at this. Because I'm, I'm trying to blow this up, man. I'm trying to go to the top with this. And I'm going to. I'm, I'm going to, bro. Um, I'm going to figure it out. I'm, like I said, I'm one of those people. I just want to be the best. So I'm going to figure it out. I'm going to be the best. But shout out to everyone who's been watching me, rocking with me since my first video. I love y'all. Like I said, I just started. So if you're hopping on now, this is the beginning, man. So make sure you subscribe. Make sure you comment your favorite takeaway. If you have another takeaway, bro, of course, drop it down in the comments below. Like I'm saying, this is a community you got. You guys are just the flyest people in the world, man. This is my key takeaway so I can help your style. Help my. This is how I'm helping my style. Like those. Are, now I'm going to look at the Dua Lipa. Now I'm going to look at the Dua Lipa's fits on like... Just, even though I'm a guy, I still look at females and how they put things together, like how they put different colors and all that. So, of course, I'm gonna check her out because I respect fly people at the end of the day. Um, Billie Eilish, bro, I don't got nothing to say to that. Like, you talk. The baby, I'm sorry, but I'm not gonna be looking at your fits when, I'm, when I don't know. I'm just not. But those are my key takeaways. Like I said, man, I love y'all for real. Um, stay tuned into the channel because you already know there's more to come. 
it's a lot more to come. I'm, but I'm coming crazy, like you already know. You know, I'm consistent with this. I'm going to the top. I love y'all. Uh, man, stay tuned. So I'll be back very soon, man.